Hey everyone, hope everyone had a good new year and uh, anyway uh, this is a video on uh, looking back over the last year of standout comics, comic books. Uh, actually my selection is mostly independent books. As I don't know, I prefer to read the independent books rather than the uh, Marvel and DC. There's a couple I've put in there that's Marvel and DC, but that's about it. Anyway, we'll get started. It's in no particular order, so I'll start off with this book. It's Aha. I think it's this year it came out. <laughs> um, it's, I think the... I won't actually I've only got this one comic of this aha uh -huh. I'd like the rest but I really like the story in it and that's the how the interior art is I'm not sure if all the comics on this run are about clowns but this one's about a clown and he's not having a good time at all in the book. I don't want to give too much away on the story. But yeah, that's a good one. And the next one, Gunslinger Spawn. I prefer this to uh, the actual Spawn books. It's more interesting. And let me find some good art. There's a full double page spread. If you can see. Um, I think I've got them all so far. And I've got the second book. That's the second book covered. I like that cover. And the next one is Spawn again, but this is King Spawn. And the inside is. Find a good page, that looks okay. It's like that. The interior art. It's kind of dark. And this series, King Spawn, it started off, I don't know, I, the first three books I didn't really like. But then, um, I don't know, I don't think it's a spoiler, but Lady Spawn shows up and it starts to get interesting. <laughs> anyway, the next one is, uh, I think everyone will know this book. Uh, Stray Dogs. I've got um, the full run from number one all the way to five, and I've got the um, the new one that's just come out. I think it's Stray Dogs, Dog Days, and I've got that coming in soon. And this is the interior art. Pretty nice book. I don't want to give the story away. But that's um, five books is the full run and then the, the broad, the, the only just released a new series, it's called Dog Deers. And I think it's only gonna run two to three books. The next one, is a long running series and I don't know how to release it I don't think it's every month well, definitely not every month but it's been going on it might have started in 2019 and it's still continuing so I'm going to include it because I like the books it's like an anthology it's a different story each uh, time it gets released is Ice Cream Man and this is number 24. 
I can't remember what this one was about. Oh, it's like a game show, that's right. It's kind of weird that, but it's okay. It gets the story over. It's kind of like a horror, kind of suspense, kind of weird. <laughs> and the next is... Uh, I don't know if many people know about this one. Is vinyl. And this was uh, a six book series and it's about a serial killer that kind of He's kind of got Alzheimer's or something, I think. And when he hears music, everything comes back to him. And he knows he's a serial killer. It's weird, but it's a really interesting book. And this was, like I said, six book run. And that's the art in there. And they released a book before vinyl that was called Plastic. That would be an interesting run to buy as well. If I might eventually buy that. This one, I don't think many people liked it. But I, I found it really interesting. It's Bunny Mask. This one's um, like, I don't really know if the actual bunny mask was actually explained i don't know if it's a person a ghost or a monster it's one of the two one of the three anyway and um, there's a voice that gets into people's heads and that's called a snitch and it tells them to do things it's an interesting book that is only like a four book run and hopefully they the bring more out to explain it a little more I think I've shown you the art inside or did I? maybe not anyways just in case I never there you go the next one is uh, Silver Coin now this is like an anthology it's a different story each book but it's kind of linked, but it's not. It's about a coin that people find. And everyone that finds the coin, something bad happens to them every time. And this one is about um, a casino. And when this guy has the coin, he gets onto a winning streak. That's not really giving the story, well, it's giving the story away, but that's a bit bad to be showing. Um, it gives the story away a bit, but it doesn't tell you the ending, so I won't say much more. Anyway, now we're on to DC. This is the DC one. It's the DC Black Label, and it's Nice House on the Lake. I think everyone's probably heard of that one. Um, this is about um, a guy invites, he's called Walter, invites a group of people into a house and they realise there's something linked between them all eventually and things start to happen and they're trapped in this house. Uh, and that's about it really and you find out later on what's going on but it's like I think it's a 12 book run and we're up to number six and it's not gonna come the rest isn't gonna come out till next year sometime well this year sometime should I say and that's the artwork and it's a uh, James Tinian that's um, the writer 
his books are good. And the last one, how to include this just so I was throwing some marvel into it, is Black Cat. I don't have all the run, but the book's kind of interesting and it's Black Cat. I like Black Cat. And this is the artwork. Anyway, that's it for the video. Please subscribe, like and ring that bell if you want to. And if you know anyone that wants to subscribe to me, please let them know. <laughs> so I'll get to that 60 subscriber giveaway. Thank you. Bye.